close to me, close enough to reach, perfect time to tell her. But I can't even put two words together. Paralyzing eyes, scanning my disguise, can't you see me hiding? What am I afraid of her finding? I know what I'm thinking But the words won't come out If eyes could speak One look would say everything About the way you smile, the way you laugh, the way you dress, the way your beauty leaves me breathless If eyes could speak I wouldn't have to talk Here we go again Trying to pretend my hands are steady The way she looks tonight isn't helping Vision's getting blurred Gotta calm my nerves It's now or never there's only one way to the answer I know what to tell her But the words won't come out If eyes could speak One look would say everything the way you smile, the way you laugh, the way you dress, the way your beauty leaves me breathless If eyes could speak, I wouldn't have to talk Maybe I could finally get it right, finally get the nerve to speak my mind And tell you the things I can't say And baby I would look into your eyes, and maybe you would finally realize Words are just words anyway If eyes could speak One look would say everything About the way you smile, the way you laugh, the way you dress, the way your beauty leaves me breathless if eyes could speak, I wouldn't have to talk. I wouldn't have to talk. I'll tell you all about the way you smile, the way you laugh, the way you dress, the way your beauty leaves me breathless. If eyes could speak, I wouldn't have to talk. It's another pawn in the game The last nail in my crucifix The slicker will never flame Never graced with my presence Such a complete stranger And you jump right into telling me You want to love with danger You want me at your door Rendezvous, you implore But I know you'll treat me like a whore And leave me broken, cold and sore You want me at your door Rendezvous, you implore After the video Attention all school students, this is just a reminder not to give birth in the girls' bathroom. Thank you. Hey, gay McBall's face. Why don't you leave some for the turtles? Ooh, good one. Yeah, I've been working on that one for a while. Just a sec. All yours. He thinks he's so cool because he has swoopy emo hair and wears tight pants to show off his rock hard ass. What? Nothing. Don't you wish these water fountains were full of like chocolate milk? Or oh my god, melted butter. Or ooh, ooh, mayonnaise. Uh, baby, we need to talk about something. You're getting kinda. Kinda what? Kinda. Moody? No. Pretty. 
No. Independent. No. Come on, baby, I'm not a mind reader. Fat. I'm sorry, but I can't be with a fat chick. I mean, my friends are already making fun of me. Yo, Mikey! I didn't know you was dating an Asian. Ew, I'm not Asian. Cause she got more chins than a Chinese phone book. Oh! Sorry, Amy. It's over. Ooh, I almost forgot my water. Bye, Amy. Can I at least have a hug goodbye? Fat girls don't get hugs. Here I am, here Later. I am. Take a picture of my hand, but you can tell it's not manicured. Oh, my flowers to see. You still are. <laughs> guessing you had the tater tot nachos for lunch. <laughs> no, I actually had the tater tot nachos, chili cheese fries, Frito lasagna, chocolate cake, and I sucked the insides out of a three pound burrito from Walmart. Walmart makes burritos? I sure hope so. Wow, if I ate all that, I would be fat. Turr. That's why I have my best friend right here to help me do all my dirty work. <laughs> yeah, I got my best friend right here. Ooh, an electronic toothbrush. Nice. Yeah. So, what's your thin inspiration? <laughs> you have a list. <laughs> no. Thin inspiration is something that inspires you to barf and be thin. Mine is this picture I found of Nicole Richie jogging on the beach. Look at her fingernails. They're naturally purple. She doesn't even have to get them painted. Oh, looks like my work here is done. Come on, Nicole. We have a hot dog eating competition to win. And that is how a vagina works. I thought this was English class. It is. But by the looks of you all, I think this information is a little more necessary. Faux shizzle. Okay, now we're going to talk about how to tell your parents you're a homosexual. Shane, listen up. Do I smell cheap whore? Oh, it's Amy! You're late, detention. But Miss Gold... That Jane, what did I say about passing notes in class? Oh, um, it's not a note. Okay, then why don't you let me read it? Sorry, I can't. Shane, what do you and Amy have in common? You all in a turning with me in hell! Yes, but there's something else. We both have gorilla feet? I don't have gorilla feet. <laughs> Neither do I. You both have detention, sad face. Now where was I? Oh yes, this is a penis. Well, let's be more realistic. That's a penis. What's a five letter word for garbage? Hmm, how many letters are in Shane? I don't know, how many? <laughs> this is detention, not math. The inspiration? <laughs> Excuse me? I used to look at stuff like that too. You know, it's funny, I thought once I lost all the weight, you know, like my whole world would change. You know, everything would get better. Girls would automatically start asking me out on dates. You know, I'd be some 
rich supermodel, my parents would accept me. And then it just hit me, you know, it was like, why the fuck does that matter? It's like, who am I trying to please? You know, if I don't even like myself, then why should anybody else? Well, you don't understand me, okay? So why don't you just stay out of it? You're beautiful, Amy. Here I am, here I stand, took a picture what? of my hand. And anyone that doesn't see that has a problem with themselves. Yeah, then I guess the whole football team must be having problems with themselves. <laughs> uh, yeah. Why are you being so nice to me? Well, you might be the biggest bitch in school, but school would be the same without you. And I don't want to lose you. It's like the nicest thing anybody's ever said to me. <laughs> well, that killed the moment. It's all you can eat bologna and clam chowder day at soup plantation. No. I'm done with that. Fine! Be a fat piglet, Amy! I don't care! I hope you die alone! I hope. Oh, 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 think I'm having a heart attack. So, anyways, should we call 911? Oh no, she passes out all the time. Hey, um. This is kind of dumb, um, but do you think you could, like, give me a, a, a um... Mom, I'm at school right now. Hey, Faggoty Ann. I can't find the damn cat. Have you seen him? Did you look under the bed? <laughs> no, Shane. There is monsters under there. I do not want to die. I'll find him when I get home. Oh, can you bring me home a box of banana Twinkies and a 40? Mom, I can't buy alcohol. I'm 18. Uh, I would do it myself, but I lost my ID yesterday, and <clears throat> I might get carded. Trust me, you won't. Fuck you, Shane! I hate you! I wish you were- Never would've had me, I wish you would die. Mom, I know, I gotta go, bye! <laughs> Found him. And then I was like, you think that's bad, Mom? I was pooping blood for a week. Wicka wicka old McDonald had a dick. Sucky sucky bitch. With a ski ski here, with a ski ski there. There a ski, there a ski, everywhere a ski ski. <laughs> Pigs pulled me over for driving under the influence, which is bullshit. All right, let's take roll. Amy? STFU, it has carbs? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop swallowing ASAP. Amy! Here and busy. Continue, Grandma. Mark? Yo, call me M. Diddy. Honey, the only thing I'm calling you is a gay homo faggot for wearing that necklace. Abby? This is Goldstein, help me! He has my body! All you had to say was here. And Shane, here. All right, so the assignment for today is to write an essay about what you want to be when you grow up. Now, I know most of you are useless and have no talent or future, so just make some shit up and present it to me by Friday, okay? Yo, can I make a rap? Mark, I don't usually suggest suicide for anybody, but, um... 
If you honestly think you're going to be a rapper, I think you should stand up, walk over to that window, jump out, crush your head on the cement, and end your life. You could have just said no. Yes, I could have. But it wouldn't have been as funny. <clears throat> right, Lucifer? <laughs> Miss Goldstein, I want to remind everybody that the Father's Day dance I helped organize is tonight, and I think everybody should be obligated to come. Okay, how about this? If you come, I'll give you extra credit. Well, I don't need extra credit. Fine, I'll give you credit to Shane. Huh? Oh, I wasn't gonna go. Too bad you're going. If I have to suffer in a hot, sweaty gym with this cum bucket and a pedo bear father, you do too. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> What's a pedo bear? All right, everybody, time for a slow dance with your father. Wanna be it? No, uh, I'm good. You know, uh, I didn't have a father either. Really? He died when I was five. Oh, cancer? No. My mother killed him. Stabbed him in the face, chopped off his balls, and threw him in a wood chipper. Oh my god. Yeah, he was kind of a douche anyways, though. I mean, I wouldn't have chopped his balls off, but what are you gonna do? So, uh, why are you here? Well, Shane, if anyone asks, I tell them I'm a paid chaperone, and I'd much rather be at home masturbating watching Dog the Bounty Hunter. But, uh, truth is, kind of like being here, you know? Watching kids with their fathers. Makes me kind of wish things were different for me. Yeah, I know what you mean. Listen, Shane, don't be like me, all right? You don't want to be 65 years old watching kids and their fathers in a sweaty high school gym that smells like a ball sack. Have your own kids. Be for them what you wish you would have had. I will. Good. And cut your hair, you look like a faggot. All right, enough of this sentimental shit. I'm gonna go get drunk in the parking lot. Hasta mañana! And that is why when I grow up, I wanna be a singer. Amy, I don't mean to crush your dreams, but just because your daddy says you're good with your mouth doesn't mean you should be a singer. Shane, you're up! A lot of people think about careers being the ultimate goal when they grow up. Or they want to make a lot of money. Or they want to be rich and famous. When I grow up, I want to be something I never had. I want to be a dad. I don't know what kind of job I'm going to have. Or how much money I'm going to make. But I know for a fact that my kid is going to have more love than anybody on this planet. And that's all I want. Good job, Shane. Have a seat. Are you crying, Mrs. Goldstein? Shut your mouth, whore! A plus, Mr. Dawson. A plus. What did I get? F! 